Warning. Uvox cannot be held liable under any circumstance for the things said in this video as it is intended for purely entertainment purposes and is not intended as educational information. None of the content in this video should be considered any kind of endorsement or encouragement to abuse any of these drugs, nor as a good source of moral values. Viewer discretion is advised. America needs perky sets, that's for sure. Because I think I can't feel my lungs. All right, fellas, let's get through this before we start dropping dead. That's the easiest A tier in the world. I absolutely adore getting plastered by the Grimace Jimis. I used to like lean. Hell, I used to even love lean, but holy shit, that's the most normie low effort shit on this list, and I cannot stand the thought of it being anything above D tier. I will genuinely snap if one of you assholes have any opposing thoughts. That is a vibe, you child predator. I can agree to that. You bitch. I just might you desperate. Up next, we have heroin. This shit makes my innie into an outie. <sighs> okay. I know what that means. This stuff always makes me feel like the Drake and Josh theme song. Something about picking me up when I'm down. I get so thirsty that it forces me to chug some of that purple flurp. You asshats just put lean in D tier. What the hell? What der? What I? I'll fix the shit ranking Barry gave it and put it at B tier. Ooh, I'm putting heroin there because my nuts get itchy beyond belief. Yeah, and it makes Jill's lips dry. Wait, what lips are you talking about? I'm glad we're heading in a positive direction with this. Ah, ah, shh. Next, we have DMT. This shit is the definition of fake news. The other Joey had 100 quadrillion good things to say about this one, but I did it and all I ended up with was a cover-up story. I'm scared. You are wise. I think I could really go for a bowl of cereal right now, but what are we thinking for this one? See, Tear, it can be fun sometimes. Oh, oh. I, I, uh, I concur. Epic and real news. And next up is Mr. Crab's favorite. Michelle and I love this stuff more than we do each other. We have ketamine family time. Absolutely. I for damn sure love injecting myself with horse tranquilizer. Oh, oh, <laughs> You are gay, Donnie. Ketamine gets an S tier, and next up we have shrooms. Shut up, gay Joe. I'm no such thing. I do want to suck on these things, though, because shit, 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 should go in a salad. Why the hell do lightweights make weed brownies when they could make shroom salads? <laughs> because the government wants to keep weed smokers. <laughs> These actually slap like Michelle when I'm too loud past 7 p.m. A tier. Barry, remember when we did a ton of shrooms in the Oval Office with that hot receptionist? <laughs> Dude, Daddy, I remember it like it was yesterday. It was a great, great day. My wife put shrooms in my breakfast cereal. Cool. Read the next one. Next up, we have weed sneed and feed. Weed is for losers. D tier. Next up is opiates. I love, I love purposely falling while going up the stairs and badly bruising my withering frame so I can easily convince my doctor to prescribe some of these bad boys. I agree. I agree. These are such an easy to get and easy to pop bonus to any experience. I can't recommend these enough if you're trying to ruin your life. S tier for sure. I for one, I'm well aware of the fentanyl epidemic sweeping our great, great nation. And I must say, how was, was it even possible to Live a happy life before it came around. I agree on the STR take. Functional brings communities together. Next up is Coca Cane. And holy hell, name a more iconic hardcore drug. This shit has been absolutely everywhere for the past 50 years. And it's been like that for good reason. Oh, I'm going I'm to have to go with an A tier ranking. Ooh, Joey. That is the most racist thing you've ever said. <laughs> How, we, how, how could you say that it's only an A tier? Many great, great Central Americans put in a lot of work for it to arrive on the Oval Office desk. You can't just dis, 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 discredit them like that. <laughs> Listen, I don't I do anything for the Hispanic vote, but this stuff usually puts me in sporadic comas. And I get heart palpitations just thinking about it. But, uh, but, uh, but please, please tell me you love it when you're on it. Please tell me that. Well, of course I love being on it, which is why I say it's an A tier. <laughs> Actually, 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 yeah, this shit makes it impossible for me to breathe. I can do an A tier. Uh. In the next up, we have DXM, but my homies call it dextromorphorphin. And this stuff has done irreparable damage to my liver and was actually how I had my first seizure, which was only when I was 15. So pardon me if I seem a little nostalgia blinded, but I'm going to say A tier. Uh, are oh, fucked. DXM's like a poor white kid's lean. Get your bread up, whitey tidy boy, and take those nostalgia blinders off. This is a C tier at best. I can respect the simplicity in acquiring this beverage of choice. <sighs> when I'm super thirsty, the first thing I reach for is either Everclear or lean. But if this is the only option, then 
Yeah, I guess I'll have some. You guys are such pricks. Next up is LSD. And let me be clear, this is an all-time home runner. I don't want to hear it. Ooh, 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 uh, oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that shit is really a different um, type of trip. Um. <laughs> Next up is meth and meth is pretty good. Barrett, are you kidding me? Meth isn't good. Oh, it's great. It's great. <laughs> it's great. America was built on meth, and I will not tolerate any disrespect to this great, great substance. I mean, seriously. Not many illegal deadly substances get their own award-winning show. <laughs> Ooh, S tier, S tier, give it the S tier. You're holding on quite well here, Joey. I'm very, very proud of you. Not many people are more proud of you than me. Speaking of which, next up is Molly, which I am very <laughs> up on right now. <laughs> Goddamn, Joey, I love you, man. Can we please get some bass hunter banging with some flashing lights in this bitch? I don't know about you, but this shit is a bitch to get and has extremely limited use cases. It's basically only for clubbing. And every time I'm in the Claire B. Werby with Michelle, the only way I can get her to even look at me is by roofing her with this colorful candy. You have trouble getting this stuff, Barry? Shit, man. I, I got you hit me up after I go to bed for a very long time in a little bit here and I can cover you. <laughs> oh, thanks, Joey. I am listening, and I hear you, Joey. This is a B tier because when it's good, it's great. But 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 you pretty much only want to take it specifically that time. It's actually <laughs> that put it in D tier. You are an absolute beta male pussy piece of shit. If you need to feel emotionally connected with someone, D tier this <laughs> trash. Who 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 Please be nice to me. F off. I will never be nice to you ever again, as long as I still draw a breath, you rotting corpse. Man, I miss this rage. And now on to alcohol that I never touched the stuff, to be honest. It's just, just wrong. Donny, how are you going to draw the line of goddamn alcohol, man? You look like the type of guy to down a couple liters of ogre broth made in a bathtub. Hey, what the f*** is ogre broth? Are you re- <laughs> And no man, alcohol is just evil, man. I didn't know you were the biggest virgin here, Don, but hey, you learn something new every day. S tier of f***ing course. Now we have crack. Uh, yes, the lower income, higher crime rate, and more melanin-friendly version of cocaine. Honestly, this shit still slaps all the same, so toss it in a tier. Hell no. I refuse to, to, to take Section 8 housing drugs. I smoke nothing but the best, the very best, believe me. Or hell yeah, I can still rank it that high. This was one of the first things I got real into in my college years. Love smoking that shit. A tier it is. Gah, gah, ah, gah, ah, gah, ah. Fuck off, fuck off, fucking shit. Ah. I have five pounds of crack on me right now. Next, we have some extremely normy shit, and that's nicotine. This is basically just a supercharged flavor and enjoyment enhancer, to be honest. I can see why companies want to stuff this bad boy down my pants and then wherever they can because it just makes sense. Yes, Joey, I completely agree with you, my friend. This little life hack will um, make all your problems go away. It literally always works. Uh, it is always there for you. Cool. Cool. I'll put it as to you. Next up is Xanax, and holy shit, this is a busybody's best friend. And it'll be your best friend as long as you pop more and more of it, otherwise it will kill you. That shit goes crazy hard, so I vote it goes in B tier. Uh, it's just so widely available and, and easy to get a prescription, of which has really helped it become an every man's drug, B tier. Yeah, it's crazy how it makes you feel like you're about to explode. Wait on, fellas. Next up is salvia and holy moly name a drug that's more try hard than this shit. You can't call yourself a drug user if all you did is smoke salvia. You're just a D&D &D dungeon master at that point. Fuck D tier failure. Sure, it's potent, but it's to the point where it's not even fun. Fun. Not even fun. Yeah, this drug is for absolute dork loser nerds. If you want to live in your own fantasy world, then this is the pussy shit for you. But if you want to be a Giga Chad, then you're better off taking literally anything else. D tier. Ephenhydramine, DPH, is next, and this is salvia, but better because you have a higher chance of being scarred, it's more readily available, and you have a lot more control over how much you take and how much you want to get <laughs> up. I'm on a C tier. <laughs> I'm a bar and I pop one of these. I immediately have every gay guy eyeballing me. I fucking hate this shit. What the what? I think you actually love that shit. I don't, I don't have to tell you anything. 
Next up is Nitro something, AKA uh, Laughing Gas. This is a And uh, I've been using Whippets this entire recording session and it is just heavenly. I love how this is by far the easiest thing to obtain on the list since we can't be to regulate it. It's like a cheat code. Just use this bad boy and you're free for a couple minutes. Uh, and then you can do it again and again. And again, my heart stopped beating, I'm pretty sure a few times. A tier, A tier. Next up, we have Jimson Weed or Dora. And let me just say, nothing messes you up quite like this. Believe me, there are zero people who want to re-trip this thing except Barry who can live out his fantasies again and again. The hallucinations range from nightmares to in insane. <laughs> I just got done strangling my fifth Michelle so hard until she turned into a black scorpion cat and melted away. Here you're actually evil dude, T tier. And here we have Kratom, which is the second best thing to come out of Thailand. Again, I can't, I can't be to regulate this bitch so this can range from a nice and fun brain booster to instant death. I think that makes it a C tier. Next up, we have Barry's Nuts. And yes, if you eat enough of this, it will fuck you up. This is the easiest thing to get, tied with the whip of whippets. You have to eat quite a bit of it before you feel anything. But I can tell you right now, this is why my face is so orange most of the time. B tier? Funny, please get out of my nuts. Man, I'm dying over here. Hell no. I stop this mescaline, which comes from cactus. And while I love using the cactus as a seat to lay my tushy on, I'm not much a fan of this psychedelic. It makes my stomach hurt way too much. And I throw up all of my ice cream. Then I'm forced to eat it again because it's still ice cream after all. Shut the hell up, Joey. McSlowey, that is such an L take from someone as weak as you. Let me tell you those uh, Native Americans were cooking with this one because this is basically LSD, but more inconvenient and bad tasting. Like nature obviously doesn't want you to eat this yet, the human spirit prevails. B tier, it's like LSD's cousin. CT, then we have Adderall and Jesus Christ, man. I can't tell you a single successful person who isn't completely wildly hopped up on this shit. Even if you don't have a DHD or some sort of attention disorder, this shit will basically give you superpowers for an hour or two. Um, and <laughs> an absolute ass tears and god damn it michelle come here you bitch it's time to die god damn i wish we were that michelle right now <laughs> now we have some hawaiian dookie water thing and it's basically basically straight up ass this shit is like weed alcohol but worse than i can't be <laughs> see tear see tear oh, damn it donnie you just made a big ass mistake i love kava i drink this shit like water and i actually love that it tastes like ass barry how the hell could you like this actual swamp water or water wait what was that last part take off your pants right now 